What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt Deville with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Trevor Bryant Jr. Get this, Trevor Bryant Jr., as you guys can see, was confined to a neck brace over a serious neck injury, okay? And this is what he had to say concerning his neck injury in 2023. He says to fans, friends, and family, I have overcame great obstacles in my last defeat. Never a shame to share my journey, but definitely comfortable to do so now. And I am happy because I am so blessed to see how strong I am against adversity. Due to my last injury, I have to end my boxing career in the ring, but I will never be done with boxing because it's my life. My story continues because I am a fighter and there will be more to come from the dream team. <laughs> Excuse me. And those are the words of Trevor Bryant. And I'm assuming his um, fight with Daniel Dubois. Um, let's see when the last time he was in the ring, honestly. Okay. Bryant. Okay, there we go. Okay. Okay, uh dude. There we go. Okay. Trevor Bryant, his last fight was against Cassius Cheney. Okay. And Cassius Cheney, of course, is um he's the fighter that fought Michael Hunter and lost to Michael Hunter. Okay. And it was by K T K O, um or KO, should I say. He lost to Cassius Cheney. Um and I guess that's where he uh developed or had his neck injury and he had to retire because of that now a lot of people that are dubois fans could take a go with this because the first time he was knocked out cold was by uh daniel dubois when he did get hit i think he was knocked out in the fourth round by dubois which dubois took the wba regular title from him and that would gave him the opportunity to fight the unified fighter with the full belt Alexander Usyk along with the IBF and the WBO titles, okay? Now, he loses to Cheney in another knockout, but how much of that could have been as a result of Daniel Dubois um, giving him that first KO? When you get knocked out, your, your neck does this weird thing, you know what I mean? It rattles your brain, okay? That's all connected there. So once you get hit and you get a neck injury to that capacity... It could be bad stuff. But the good news of Trevor, Trevor Bryant, he is without the neck brace. He just had to retire from the sport. So obviously, whatever the injury was, you know, he had to quit boxing. So the injury or injuries um, he withstood from Cassius Cheney or Daniel Dubois, okay, took a career changing toll on his career, at, you know, overall. So that's crazy, okay? And that just shows you this is the sport that I love that I hate so much. And that's for a reason, people, because one injury can take you out of the game completely, okay? But the good thing is he doesn't need to brace. He's walking. He's healthy. And he's going to be okay. He can live his life like any other bloke walking around breathing, you know, this good God green air, right? But you guys tell me what you think of... Trevor Bryant, and I'm glad that he is back in stride. You guys tell me what you think. Again, please subscribe, and you guys been counterpunch. Peace!